Hi, my name is Jamin Ferguson. I'm a developer relations engineer here at PayPal. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to create your own developer account and access your developer dashboard to start building apps with PayPal. The first thing you need to do is open up developer.paypal.com. Go ahead and once you're here, click login to dashboard. Here, you have two real options. The first is to log in with an existing personal or business account, or you can click the sign up button to create a free developer account. For most of you getting started today, a developer account is probably your best bet. It's super easy to set up and has built in restrictions to prevent you from accidentally sending real money. As of right now, developer accounts are only available in the United States. So if you're outside the US, you'll need to choose one of those other options. Now type in an email address and your secure password. Just be sure not to use an email address already associated with an existing PayPal account, or you might get an error like this. So I'm gonna go ahead and use something different and get that account set up. Once we sign up, we're taken here to our developer dashboard. In the dashboard, we can see our applications and sandbox accounts, as well as all sorts of other utilities to help us build and test applications using PayPal APIs and SDKs. You also have access to all of our documentation up here in the header. Go ahead and click on the accounts page and you'll notice that you have two sandbox accounts already created for you. You have a business account and a personal account. If you click the view and edit account option under manage accounts for either of those, you can see the credentials for these users. These credentials only work on sandbox.paypal.com, which is a fully working copy of the PayPal code base specifically set up for testing your applications. So you can log in with these credentials on Sandbox to view account activity or transfer money between your accounts. The other thing I wanna show you is the My Apps and Credentials section, where you can find an existing app called Default Application. This along with the Sandbox users was created automatically for you when you first logged in to your developer dashboard. If you click in here, you can see that this application is associated with the merchant account that we just looked at, and the client ID is also here, which you'll need to use our SDK or when accessing any PayPal APIs. So that's a brief overview here of how to set up a PayPal developer account and how to access your developer dashboard. Happy coding.